want me to do your hand model? Turn it over? Sure. And what's it? Uh, what's the official Verizon designation for it? Uh, this will be the uh, BlackBerry Pearl. Cool. It is uh, 3G, EV, uh, EVDO enabled, so this will be the first broadband enabled um, BlackBerry. And you said the first with a camera. Uh, well, the existing BlackBerry Pearl has a camera, but it is it is the the first. Um, most of the other Blackberries don't have the camera. Cool. So this is it's the first one the, we uh, carry. The little trackball I love so it does. much with mine. Yeah, you get used to that really quick. Yeah, uh, yeah. I mean, nobody miss, really misses the thumb wheel. And um, the cool thing, uh, one of the, it's got uh, the smaller keypad with two keys on it. Right. But it has a very intuitive software. Um, yeah, what do they it. call that? I've, I've, I've read about like, that. I've not used it. Maybe, but. I'm not sure. I think it's QuickType or I've read something good things like about that. It. I've read really good things it's, about it. I, you know, when I first uh, saw it, I was like, oh, that's going to take some getting used to. And somebody, and somebody that was using it said, you know, you'd be surprised how intuitive it is and how quickly you will pick it up. It, it really does. It's that kind of, you know, it's like the T9 predictive, you know, thing. It will. Uh, press it up. You can see the full keyboard here. All looks familiar to me. Yeah. I love my BlackBerry. Yeah, I mean that one. You can see it's it's very much takes some of its uh, style cues from the global BlackBerry. Um, mm -hmm. The metallic look into it. Um, the trackball. And again, it has uh, some subtle differences, and it's much smaller given the uh, smaller keypad. Okay, guys, what's up? This is the new Verizon Juke. It's got this, uh, I mean, it's kind of spring loaded, so when you just like nudge it that way, it opens all the way. Very kind of consumer music centric. Um, it is a 1x device as opposed to an EVDO device, so it does not incorporate the over the air type uh, you know musical right. download. But from a side load standpoint, this is much easier to use than than previous uh, editions. It's essentially you just use the USB cable, plug it into your computer, and it mounts as a USB as a volume, and you can just drag um, music over to it. And uh, in addition to just plain MP3s and Windows Media files, it will also accept AAC files. So iTunes users can transfer their AAC files. Now it will not not the DRM not the DRM versions, but ones that they've that they've uh, you know like. Uh, ripped from uh, CDs and converted to AACs, things like that, can, you can use on this. No expandable cool. memory, wow, but... it's very narrow. It is. No expandable memory, but it has two gigabytes of storage built in. Uh, it, do, it, it doesn't do, like, Vcast mobile, team, you know, the video and things like that, because it's not EVDO enabled, but it will take uh, Get It Now applications, and it also is v, uh, VZ Navigator compatible. So it has uh, location-based services. So can you flip it, just flip it over? Just show the back of it. Camera. That's good. Camera. Two megapixel VGA camera. Cool. What's on the side of that? It has, uh, mute, it has volume, volume buttons. Over here, it's a lock. Okay. And when you close that, the, the outside LCD was really cool. Nice, big, vivid. Oh, yeah. So that's cool. Now it has a uh, button and track wheel. Ah, very familiar interface. Uh huh. That's cool. So, track wheel.
Get the can left. Where is the camera? Ah, that is the camera. Okay. So, and this is the Verizon Juke. That's cool. And that's made by Samsung. Right? It is. The Samsung device. They uh, great phones. They do, and they're really, they really they're really uh, stepping it up. They uh, have got some cool new designs. Um, we just announced one today called the Gleam. It's got a very kind of shiny, reflective coating on the outside. The uh, wallpaper on the uh, thing it is uh, dynamic, so it actually has animation on the wallpaper, and it changes appearance during the course of the day with the time of the day at oh, night. It cool. becomes a nighttime scene. That's little little All things right. like that. What else have we got in this the bag of tricks? This is the Venus. Uh, form factor, reminiscent of the chocolate. Ah, uh, yeah. But dual with screen. A dual screen. Touch screen up top. Standard screen down below. Ah, that's interesting. And you've got images that go across. Uh, images will go yeah, across I just both saw that. screens. Yeah, that's pretty cool. So you have the music key. Damn, yeah, that's really small. Yep. Now, the nice do. standard keypad that slides out. Ah, I see. Now, you, if you feel it, it's got vibration um, cues. Yeah. When you press a button, it, it vibrates slightly to let you know it's got a tactile key oh, cue. Oh, that's awesome. To let you know. This is made by LG. This is the LG Venus, that's right. Okay. Um, so it's got... So the bottom is a touch screen. Then. It is a touch screen. Um, yes, only one of the two is a touch screen. This top okay, one the is top not. one's not. Yeah, the top okay. one is not. The bottom, I'm sorry. I no, that the, makes more sense. Sit that backwards, that, that, yeah. yeah. No, that's, that's cool. I just got this, so I haven't had a this chance to load it. This is the Venus. In. Yeah. Oh, you gotta get some music on. Them. I know. I just got this. Yeah, that's what's cool. Yeah. So, is there a camera? Is that on the back as well? Two megapixel. Yeah. The back. Two megapixel camera on the back. Yeah. Awesome. Uh, yeah, I'm impressed with how thin that is as well, even though it's a slider. Is the micro SD part oh, cool. slot? And it's outside where you get to it. Yeah, I like that. Yeah, so I like micro SD. That do that. Sandisk has announced just announced eight gigabyte. Yeah, so yeah, actually eight gigabyte storage. I've heard that from now. Kingston is doing some stuff like that too. Yeah. This is your plug for your charger. Cool. It's got the uh, headset plug. Headset plug. Volume, speakerphone. Oh, that's cool. I like a dedicated speakerphone button. Yep. I've used a few phones recently, you know, recently that don't have that. You don't realize yeah, you, how important yeah, that really. is until you, until you don't have one. That's a cool interface, that touch screen at the bottom. That's a unique and innovative way to do that, actually. Yep. So the main screen. It's just the top screen, the bigger one, is, is just a regular non-touch screen, so I'm sure that's got good cost implications for the consumer. Yeah, it does. I mean, this one's going to be more expen uh, less expensive than the, uh, the Voyager. They haven't announced pricing on them, but, uh, you know, the way it's going to rack out, you're going to... I knew you would be able to talk about pricing, because they yeah. haven't announced it. Uh, this one, I think I've heard some... The Juke, I've heard someone, some people say under 100. And we, which you know, you know, in the real world, probably means ninety nine, ninety five. Yeah. But uh, and the next step up will be the Venus, and then the, the third tier will, top tier will be the Voyager. Okay. Well, that's cool. Well, speaking of the Voyager, all right, let's uh, get to it. Shall let's we? get to it. That's the one that's got me 
unique side, and not just me. I mean, it, it's created a lot of buzz. The announcement yeah. that was made earlier this yeah. week, which is pretty cool. So let's see. Nice little case. Does it come with a case? I assume it does. It comes with a case. So there's the uh, Verizon Voyager, also made by LG. It's the LG 10,000, or 10K is the uh, model number, but it'll be it'll be marketed as the Voyager. And of course, it's a full V-cast phone, so it's EVDO. It is. It's EVDO. It really has all things in it. In in addition to being, um, let's see, it also has the visual cues. There's the icon today's screen. Those seem to always get everybody excited. I don't know why. Oh, that's awesome. That that right there. That's that's the big advantage in my mind to the over the iPhone. Same size screen. That's a big inside. Too. That's easy to use. It is. It's a it's a little bigger than the uh, the Envy. Big, easy to use. My stepdaughter has the Envy. She loves it. But I, you know. I, Oh, that's awesome. So you got a little, it's kind of like a D-pad there. Yep. For navigation. That's yeah, you've nice. got a little direction up there. And how did you open that? Was there something you had to do, or did you just pull it open? Just pull it open. Just pull it open like that. The way it should be. Now, <laughs> yeah, it, it is. Got a pad here you can use for the number. It's a nice big screen. Yeah. Or of course, you know, you've got that. But this is really the easier way to send a text message. Oh, sure, sure. Well, that's still one of the big complaints you often hear about the, the iPhone. Is yeah, I, I mean, they're in keyboards. It's got a soft keyboard so here. Far, it's got a know? soft keyboard here. If you want to keep it closed, that's fine. Um, you can operate it either way. That's that's cool. So how thin is that guy? I want to see if he's going to get a feel for it. Wow, it's a lot thinner than I thought with that keyboard. Yeah. So there's my fingers. There's like a micro SD slot over there. It does. Again, oh, same micro side. SD. Cool. Headphone jack. Headphone jack. You've got a lock button here on the side. If you what you need it. with a touch screen. You do. You do. Yeah. The uh, camera button. Volume up and down. Where is the camera? Two megapixel. Two megapixel. Cool. I like that phone. I mean, I have to admit that every every smartphone that I've used yeah. that has a keyboard, texting and email is just so much easier. Yeah. Does support our VCast Mobile TV, oh, that's so it's the stereo broad features. Yeah, it has stereo the speakers on the inside. Oh. VCast Mobile TV is our broadcast TV, live TV uh, technology. Not available here in Houston currently. Oh, uh, what's up with that? Uses uh, Qualcomm's building. It's Qualcomm's network. They're building it. It relies on um, broadcast spectrum, channel 55. Which well, here, if they need tech content, have them give me a call. Yeah, well, it, we'll, we'll uses, fix them up on JK. It relies on channel 55. Wow, that's a good which is And that's coming in, is that streaming now or this is that stored? This is actually stored. Okay. But it's full motion broadcast. Well, EVDO, video. I mean, I've, I've yep. streamed fine all the time. Yeah, the broadcast, the technology though, and, and you'll see because it is here. Is the antenna? Oh, you got a little antenna for the broadcast for the mobile TV. Oh yeah, it's really small when it's in your hand. It is. I can really improve. So that's the antenna. Let's see how small that thing is in your hand. Oh yeah, that's cool. That's really cool. So, what's your favorite feature of it? Everything, right? Uh, you know, it's hard to say. Bcast. Uh, for me, it would be have to be a, what I've seen 
just so far is a combination check of the interface and the keyboard. Yeah, exactly. And check out this amazing technology, not to be found on the other phone. The battery can be removed and replaced. Oh, while it's, <laughs> while it's... No, not while it's running, but... No, I didn't yeah, think but so. you, There's extended batteries available, and one of the, the problems with the, uh, the iPhone is it's got that built-in integrated battery. Right. You have to send it back to Adam, Apple to get it replaced. Yeah. And, and rent a phone while you're while they're doing it. So, so. here you just replace it yourself. Exactly. Get an extra you get one. an extra one. And you said there's an extended battery? Yes. Oh, that's cool. Yep. So. Which, I mean, let's face it, if you're going to start doing video, and that's what iPhone owners are finding yeah. out, I mean, it's nice streaming to have. video takes it does. some juice, you know? It does. It certainly does. So it's a nice little stereo TV. It is. It's, a, it's got it's TV, music, video, up to 8 gigabytes of uh, storage in the uh, micro SD. That's cool. It's so this is the Verizon Voyager. When when are these four scheduled for actual availability? The Juke will be available within uh, the next few weeks in October. Okay. The Voyager, the Pearl, and the Venus will be available in November. Pearl first, Venus second, Voyager third. Okay. Certainly, well before the uh, you know the uh, the holiday buying frenzy. Which I'll be doing. My wife's already told me she needs a new phone. Yeah, but uh, it's got. Uh, I gotta turn that around quick. This is really cool. I like this can. Ah, so it's got this slider touch screen kind of. Yeah, there's not enough choices here, but. Oh yeah. Well, yeah, you don't have any messages or anything. Makes it hard to. Oh, we got a guy coming. Oh, I appreciate it. 